It is move-in week at the, uh, in the Pittsburgh area as local universities welcome students to their campuses. And that can mean some traffic disruptions around town. Money Editor John Delano has more. It's move-in day for area universities. So don't be surprised if you find traffic a mess in Oakland or on the bluff or in downtown Pittsburgh this week as parents and others help kids get started with a new experience. I am moving into college for the first time, yeah, as a freshman. Carl Alquist from Philadelphia is just one of thousands of young people making the move, in his case, to the University of Pittsburgh. I'm very excited, a little bit nervous, but I'm really excited to see what this year has for me, and uh, I want to want to get going. I want to start doing school. Pitt's move-in day means temporary road closures in Oakland including parts of Bigelow Boulevard, University Place, Lothrop Street, North Bouquet Street, Thackeray Street, and University Drive. Duquesne University's move-in starts on Tuesday, when more than 1,300 incoming freshmen arrive on the bluff. While last Saturday, Carnegie Mellon welcomed freshmen like Alice Zilberberg from Boston, with students there to help her. It's surprisingly fast considering how much stuff everybody's bringing and how everybody's moving in on the same day. Downtown at Point Park University off the Boulevard of the Allies in Wood Street honors students and students at the Conservatory of Performing Arts moved into their dorms on Monday, while the big move for the rest of the university occurs on Tuesday. Over 200 upperclassmen and faculty volunteer to help the freshmen move in while others serenade. At all universities, for parents dropping off their kids, it's a mix of sadness and relief. It's about time. <laughs> no, no, I'm looking forward to his, for his experience being in college. John Delano, KDKA.